Thank anyway, you. here's Jeff. <laughs> Jeff, great. He Hi, was Jake. our contestant, if you remember, and he's uh, been a millionaire all the time. He's known the Lord all his life, probably. How long? Yeah, actually, only about 14 years. Well, how old are you? I thought you uh, were... Well, that's a well-kept secret, and if I told you, I'd have to kill you. Sit down. But I'm almost 50, actually. I don't want actually. you to kill me yet. <laughs> <laughs> cool. But uh, I'm sure if there's any uh, teenagers out there, they're all saying, Hey, there's Jeff. Come here. Let's see. Let's Jeff. Because <laughs> yeah, uh, Jeff uh, works with the kids. He's with uh, Foursquare. He go to the Foursquare mm -hmm. church with, uh, that we talked about. And uh, uh, he works with the kids with the Young Life. Tell me, what is the Young Life about? Let's get that out. Okay, well, Young Life was started about 60 years ago by a gentleman named Jim Rayburn. And he had a real heart for the lost and for kids that didn't get an opportunity to go to church. And so he started this, what we call, parachurch organization, para, para meeting alongside. And to supplement the youth programs in the churches, he started this program to reach out to those kids that just had never heard the gospel. So. Uh, basically, that is our, our target group, is the kids that, uh, that don't come from Christian families. And it's grown to a nationwide movement. Uh, here in town, it uh, started about four years ago with Gary and Dee Dee Hudak with about four to six kids. And it's grown now to uh, about 75 to 100 kids we have each week at club. We meet once a week. Uh, the club consists of uh, some songs. We sing some like secular, fun, oldie songs. And then we sing some worship songs. And we have some skits and games. And then we have a short message. Because uh, as you know, teenagers have sometimes a short attention span. Mm -hmm. but, uh, but they get, get really blessed by the whole fun time we have. And uh, we've had over half the high school kids come to one of our clubs wow. at one time or another. And uh, it's just been a real blessing to get to know the teenagers oh, in this so community. Great that that's coming, that's happening here. And you probably, most people, unless they have children, don't realize that something like that is going on for the children here. We don't see any graffiti on, uh, on the walls around here and, and stuff like that. Maybe a, a few of the eggs thrown. We got one out here, you know. But, you know, kids will be kids, and we can't blame it all on them either, you know. But if they have something to do like that, you know, then that's all they're looking for. They wanted a, sk a skateboard park, and we still don't have it, I don't think, you know. We need to get some of these things so that they can get, uh, get the, some of this energy out, you know. And you're doing a lot of that. In fact, you did. All, you took a bunch of them. You took some of the energy out of them down in Mexico, I think. How many went down there? Uh, we had 79 kids go in about 12 adults. Wow. Yeah, it was, uh, <clears throat> it was quite an event. Uh, it's probably one of the more popular things that the high school kids do in this community. Yeah, the, uh, it was in the newspaper. Let's see, this is in the May 12th Bonanza. I don't know if anybody ever gets that paper around here. But, uh, and I see your picture in here. You're looking pretty sharp here with your hair. And what poverty is like, and especially with kids from Incline who are used to the, the opulence and the wealth that's here, uh, it's a real eye-opener eye for them. And they just are really blessed by the service that they perform, by the hard work that they do, by the smiles they bring on the kids' face, or the parents' and face. And I see you're actually building these houses. You're actually lifting these walls into place and mm -hmm. stuff like that. You're just not down there... Uh, uh, you know, having a party or something. You're actually doing a lot of work. And uh, I see Donna DiCaprio is in the paper mm -hmm. here, too. So uh, her family have have been such a blessing to this community, and particularly now with uh, Young Life. Jeff, this is great. I think this is a beginning. That maybe we can help you a lot with Get Real in this way. But I'd just like to see you more on this show. I think we had fun. But did, did you like my millionaire outfit? Uh, yeah, I just had to say, Jay, you, did anyone ever tell you you look a lot like Regis Philbin? <laughs> <coughs> I'm the king. No, I say. God yeah. bless. God bless you, bro. <laughs>